all right guys i want to show you how you can set trading a lot on your relative strength index use this relative in, uh, relative strength index to get um a certain confirmation in the market like to know the overbought zone to know the oversold zone of it and you can actually use it to generate a signal you understand if you know how to use it very well but what i want to show you is simple how you can get an alert to your phone by setting these parameters you understand by setting um relative strength in this whenever i get to a board zone it should give you a notification or whenever i get to a sold zone it will give you a notification there are sometimes those days i used to trade with um, relative strength in this there's a way i normally do it i'll set an alert on relative strength in this um daily four hours one hour 30 minutes and uh, 15 minutes all of them must be above 50 before i could take any decision in the market you understand those are pretty old strategy that i normally use but they still work though but based on the fact i'm focusing on just two strategy that is what i'm just telling you there are a lot you can do with um, setting an alert you understand monitoring different time frame and let them align at the same time you'll be able to use it to generate money in the market so for now i want to show you how you can set um, trading alert using Beckner trading journal by setting the relative strength index to any value of your choice it might be 10 it might be 50 it might be 100 whatever value that you're looking for you'll be able to do it first thing first you need to do is logging into the trading app before you do all this before you receive a notification make sure you activate this just click to activation activation center immediately you click that select this to make sure you're seeing a token if you're not seeing a token you will not receive any any notification at all no matter how you set it you're not going to receive any notification just click and activate your notification by clicking show notification menu just click yes that's all the system will recognize your device so let's go back and let me show you how you can set your relative strength in this and set an alert just click here you see this point here you see this value here where is it you see this one set indicator alert which is relative strength in this so immediately i click it will open a different page for me it's pretty simple open a different page for me i'll click click to set relative strength in this this is just the page that you're seeing you select symbols immediately i click any of this symbol the, the value of this pra, um, um, gbp usd related strength in there is supposed to appear here but it's not showing that means the software cannot carry out this function meaning that the market is closed at this moment sorry the market is closed at this moment that's why you are not seeing any value so let's use any crypto pair that we have here at least we have a um, btc as you can see btc just display the current value in one minute so as i see it so the software will be able to carry out this function for me so what do i want this value to do now if the, the current value of one minute is a uh, 30 4.55 that's the value but i want to get an alert if the value goes above 50 i'll set my time frame to be one minute maybe i'm a scalper or something condition must be higher than 50 i'll just put anything that is going to remind me once price once ros value i mean it's not price arrow si value value is above above 50 please alert me simple simple and straightforward so this software now will now be looking for comparing this price all the time whenever the please value is above 50 it will send a notification to this device so immediately i click send i'll get a feedback message that relative strength index which is rsi alert set simple and straightforward you can minimize close the software and be doing whatever thing you're doing it will get you a lot pretty simple without vps without anything everything comes directly to your android device or ios phone that's what i have for today thank you